She said all of this only so we move into her house? Oh my god, I'm getting deja vu similar drama starting. Yes, last time she also did same. She wanted us to move in her house. And when we said it doesn't feel right, she stopped talking. That's why we moved to her house. Gamuji, we came here so things will be easy with pregnancy. But I feel sad in the situation. I don't think it will be good for baby. What should we do? Biju, don't worry. I will do my best to solve this problem. I can't see you sad. Especially these days, you shouldn't be sad at all. I'm going to speak to dad and find a solution. But before that, I need you to give me a smile. Everything is under control, honey. Smile. Smile. That's like my girl. Keep smiling. I'll be right back with a solution. Just remember, this problem is not big, okay? Thank you, Gamuji. You always make me happy. Well, we shouldn't forget Pichu is their only child. Obviously, they want to keep her close. Nothing wrong in it. What was wrong? The way she manipulated, which made Pichu sad. We don't have any problem if you move into their house. I'm just concerned if Pichu's mom is going to manipulate her in another way, which is not good. What do you suggest we do that? It is between Pichu and her mother. I think it's Pichu who should speak to her mom and dad. I don't like this idea. Pichu is very innocent. And her mother will manipulate her again. Pichu will fall for it. Can we not do something else? Don't worry, Gomu. We aren't abandoning Pichu. She isn't alone. Now listen what Pichu should say and do. Great idea, Dad. I will tell Pichu right away. First, I close my eyes. And you all hide, and whoever I catch first will be the next to find us all, okay? I count now. One, two, three, four, five. I'm coming. So here is the plan, Pichu. Okay, Gamuji, I will do that. I hope it doesn't hurt my mom.